Coming up on Metro 5 this week, we'll celebrate former Justice of the Supreme Court, Justice George Adeshola Oguntade, his 81st birthday, and of course, the successful completion of his tenure as Nigeria's High Commissioner to the United Kingdom. Still in the birthday mood, we also bring you the 50th birthday of Lady Josephine Ozekume, wife of renowned senior advocate of Nigeria, Mr. Mike Ozekume. Wow, it's all about birthdays today on the show, and I welcome you all as you join me to celebrate these amazing Nigerians. Now, it's another edition of Metrofile, and let's get it started, shall we? As always, kindly watch out for sensitive images. Once again, welcome to the program. I am Ogechuku Osi Oyeludi. Okay, he served as Nigeria's High Commissioner to the United Kingdom for three years. Former Justice of the Supreme Court, Justice George Adeshola Oguntade, has successfully completed his tenure. Now, his family and close friends put together a befitting reception to welcome him back home, having served meritoriously. Now, this also coincides with his 81st birthday. Enjoy it. A man of character, distinction, and remarkable achievements, Justice George Adeshola Oguntade is undoubtedly one of the most renowned legal minds that ever sat on the higher bench in Nigeria. In his service on the bench, he made a mark in the advancement of the nation's legal system, and the records are out there for all to see. Upon retiring as a Supreme Court judge, Justice Obutade had a lot more to offer his fatherland, and so, with the same dedication, hard work, and the will to succeed, he also served as the Nigeria High Commissioner to the United Kingdom, a position to which he was appointed by President Muhammad Buhari in 2017. His tenure came to an end after serving in that capacity for three years. To thank him for a job well done and also welcome him back home, his family and close friends put together a befitting reception which coincides with his 81st birthday. The reception began with an open-air communion service at his residence in Lagos, strictly attended by family and very few close friends of the celebrant. The Anglican Bishop of Lagos, His Lordship, the Right Reverend Humphrey Olumakaye, led other clergies of the Anglican Church to celebrate this distinguished Nigerian who has also dedicated his life to the service of God as a former Chancellor of the Church of Nigeria, Anglican Communion. Through him, you have freed us from all the slavery of sin, giving him to be born as man and to die upon the cross. You raise him from the dead and exalted him to your right hand on high. Through him you have sent upon us your holy and life-giving spirit and made us our people for your own possession. Enter to his gates with thanksgiving, and it is 
discuss his praise. Be thankful to him and bless his name. For the Lord is good. This mercy is everlasting and excludes and deals to all generations. Justice Ogutade's numerous accolades also includes being the pro-chancellor of the Lagos State University. In 2010, he was honored with the National Award of the Commander of the Federal Republic for his outstanding contributions to the legal profession. What is expected of you is to praise him and rejoice in him. Verse 3, who forgives all your iniquities, who heals all your diseases. It's because of the mercy of God. That is why you and I are not being consumed. It is because Christ died on the cross so that we can have a place in his kingdom. He died so that we can have his own righteousness. He died so that you and I can be called somebody in the society. The Gibraltar Orchestra supplied soothing music for the listening pleasure of everyone here. The celebrant, family and friends now step forward for the special Thanksgiving. and a birthday song for the celebrant. things the right way and the wrong thing the wrong way. I rely on God and I'm sure that the reliance will see me through in life. The second segment of the event starts right away. Of all he has achieved, he is most importantly a father to his children who call him blessed. He's a very humble person and uh, all that came his way he took uh, 
with the very stoic uh, Christian uh, faith. But uh, the family is delighted that he's here, he's back in good health, most importantly. Uh, we're all happy, we're all delighted. He's really been graced. Apart from anything else, I've seen the grace of the Lord operating in his life over and over and over again. And he's the kind of person that when it seems tough, when it seems like it's over, from nowhere God just picks him up all over again. You can see that he still looks very strong and I'm sure that he will slow down a bit but he will still be available to do many more things. But we want to have him relax a bit. At the occasion are his friends of many years, and one thing common about what they have to say about the celebrant is that he is a good man. He deserves all the accolades that the pastors, the reference and everything has been given him. I wish him good health, long life and all and blessings. He's a complete gentleman, peaceful, honest, very, very honest, easy going. He's a good man. We have been together since youth. And we have been so many years, we do so many things together. He's one of my best friends. A man that has worshipped God in church. A man that has served at the highest point of the judiciary in the land. An eminent jurist. He served well there and he's back here. We give God all the glory for his beautiful character. He's indeed a true son of Nigeria. Representatives of the celebrant's grandchildren spoke on behalf of the rest of them, and then other goodwill messages followed. Um, Grandpa, many happy returns, sir. We love you very much. We're very, very, very proud, very happy to be your grandkids, and happy birthday. He was as youthful as he was brilliant, and he was always able to catch all the tricks of the boys. Now, all our attempts to get frivolous adjournments failed because he was a very active practitioner. And um, if you came to court not prepared, you really felt very, very silly. We're all standing here, and my Lord is standing taller, and he's even looking sexy at the age of 81. My prayer for you, my Lord, is that you continue to get stronger and stronger. As your years go more, so shall your strength be. You will have the power of David at all times. Chief Samuel Adedui prays for his friend. All good things will be our portion, and God Almighty will protect us. For the rest of our life, we will not lack but we will all receive the blessing of God. For our prayer in Jesus Christ's mighty name. Amen. And it's time to cut the cake. J J E S U S. traveled out of the, this country for about uh, three years ago and I've learned a lot there and I want to counsel that all of us in our respective homes must endeavor to see that whatever we do wherever we go whatever we say Nigeria comes first <laughs>
A great day for Justice George, Adishona Guntade, and the rest of the family as they dance into the night. Here's to many more celebrations. We say happy birthday to him and we thank him for his service to our dear country, Nigeria, in every capacity he has served. All right, we're not done just yet. When we return, we go to Abuja. Join us again. <laughs>